am so excited because today I have a super special guest. This is Hamali, also known <laughs> as Ready to Glow on all of her socials. And I'm so excited because we are going to be transforming and giving her this gorgeous, vampy prom makeup look. She's also done my makeup, so head over to her socials to check out this tutorial. And if you guys want to see how to get this look, then keep on watching. All right, first things first, we're gonna move through the brows pretty quickly. I'm just using a brow pomade by ColourPop, and then we are sealing these down so they stay in place all day long with some Benefit Brow Gel. Moving on to the eyes, I'm just priming the eyes with my good old Tarte Shape Tape Concealer, and then just buffing a translucent powder so it doesn't move. Going into my Jaclyn Hill Times Morphe palette and I'm going into a really nice light brown shade just to warm up her crease. So I'm just doing little circular motions and then back and forth motions on the outer V of her eyelid and then right directly into the crease. And now I'm just building that up with a little bit of a deeper brown shade. Next I'm going to go into my Venus 3 palette by Lime Crime and I'm just dipping into that really nice plum shade. And I'm building up a bit of texture and depth to really give it that dramatic ombre blend. So I'm keeping the dark Dark shade lower down into the crease. Next we are going to cut the eyelid. I just love doing this. I feel like it really tidies up any makeup look and really makes the inner half of your eye pop. So I'm using my Tarte Shape Tape, really really taking my time and then packing on some translucent powder so that it doesn't move around. Next up I'm taking my blending brush and I'm just diffusing the concealer and the eyeshadow so everything looks nice and effortless. And then we're gonna move into my eyeliner and just give her a nice little wing. Okay, for my favorite part, we're gonna go into my NYX Glitter Glue, and this is how you lock down any loose glitter that you may be using. And then once that gets kind of tacky, I'm going to start layering that glitter on top, and that just ensures that it's not gonna move around and fall and crumble away throughout the night. It's going to stay in place, and I'm just obsessed. I think glitter looks fantastic for proms. We're gonna pop on some Huda Beauty lashes, and then we're just going to perfect this eyeshadow. I always like to go in afterwards to just kind of define the crease a little bit more. That's why I'm adding some shadow to the top of the crease. Moving on to the face, you guys know it. This is the Smashbox Primizer, and I'm just going to prep and prime her face so it's nice and hydrated. Next, we're gonna conceal and color correct. So this is the NYX color corrector. So whenever you have dark pigment, you wanna look on your color wheel if you guys don't know what shades to use and you're using the opposite shade from the color wheel. So if you have like purpley blue pigment, you wanna color correct that with orange and that's gonna cancel out any of the discoloration. And you'll notice if you don't do that, sometimes it can look really ashy or it just doesn't do a good job of covering. Now I'm gonna mix my NARS foundations to make a nice little concoction I am like the queen of mixing products. I find that it just like works so much better. Um, so I'm mixing a nice little shade for her and then we're just gonna blend this to perfection. Next I'm gonna go into two of my concealers. This is the Tarte Shape Tape mixed with the Makeup Revolution Concealer. And I really like to accentuate this highlight, especially when I'm working on anybody that has a little bit more color, a little bit more of a tan, because it really, really helps contrast their face. She also has a super cute tiny face, so I can get away with highlighting a little bit more. So because she has a nice tiny face, I don't wanna contour too much, um, because she doesn't really need it. She has like the ideal face shape. So I'm just going to contour her cheekbones and underneath her jawline. She has a really nice tiny forehead jealous, so I'm not gonna contour up there. So whenever we use cream products, you wanna set them with powder and that's really going to lock in your product and it's not gonna move around you all night long. So I'm just setting my contour and then we're gonna go into this really nice banana powder to set underneath her eyes. Next up, I'm just gonna jump back to the eyes to finish the bottom and smoke it all out. Going back into my Jaclyn Hill palette and a little paintbrush and I'm just putting a little bit of color and definition down there. For blush, I'm going into my Kiss Modern Renaissance blush. I absolutely love this, especially for like proms because it gives you a really nice sheen. And I'm just gonna let her coat her lashes with some mascara. It's usually easier if you do them yourself. So whenever I do a client, I usually ask them if they want to do them themselves. Okay guys, are you ready to rum roll, please? Trust me, when we opened this, we were so in shock, we almost dropped it on the floor. It is so stunning. So this is the Huda Beauty All Over Body Highlighter. 
That is a mouthful, but this is seriously so stunning, so shimmery, but it gives you like the most gorgeous radiance from within. It is amazing. So I'm also gonna highlight her nose, and then we're gonna move on to lips. So this is the NARS Lip Stain, and it is the most stunning pink shade. It goes so well with her skin, and I feel like we just wanted to do a little bit of a punch of color. If you're doing like a pink dress or a black dress, this is gonna look so perfect. And I'm also lining the lips with my Makeup Forever Lip Liner just to give them a little bit more of that like ombre vibe and make them look a little bit more defined and juicy. Last but not least, we are going to put this Huda Beauty Drops all over the body. I am seriously obsessed and her channel is ready to glow. So we are getting her ready to glow. I feel like this is absolutely stunning. It comes in shades of light, medium, and dark, so a shade for everyone. And it just brings your skin to life. If you have dull skin, it just gives it that really nice sheen, glow from within, perfect for proms, weddings, or photos. Alrighty guys, here is the finished result. Let me know what you guys think down below if you guys like this video and if you wanna see more collabs. And remember to go over to her channel at Ready to Glow and check out this tutorial that she did on me. And remember to click the bell in the top right corner to get notified every single time I post. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.